Welcome to Big Breeds and Crypto. I'm your host, Mr. Big Breeds, coming to you live from a reservation somewhere, taking a look at NCT and a few other coins to continue the night. Well, let's get it started. Take a look at NCT. NCT's actually made some moves to the upside, but as far as taking a look at it, you know, on the outside picture looking in, it's <laughs> it looks like it's already basically tried to test the support one, two, three times. If it does come, I mean, test this resistance. If it does, you know, tend if it tries that again, does get denied, it's definitely going to be pulling down to a lower price action. More than likely, coming down to that uh, retest this support at 0.0426. Uh, possibly get some consolidation and next move up to that 786. We do lose that support there. We're definitely going to start looking at, you know, how low can you go? So, you know, that scenario could start possibly on the table. But if we do get back over this uh, 786 at point oh six nine eight, uh, definitely looking for some consolidation and next move up. We've got to make our way up to this uh, point oh nine one one, get some strong support and start making our way, our way to the upside. So as far as NCT, uh, you know, definitely got to keep an eye on that price action. Definitely got to keep an eye on BTC. BTC's, uh, you know, still undecided at this point. And uh, I've been keeping an eye on the the shorts and the longs. Uh, you know, at this point, you know, could it be making a decent run towards the upside? If it does get rejected here, uh, definitely looking for some pullback to a you know lower price action. And uh, you know, Mr. Big Bray's does. You know, I I love this pattern when it starts setting up on the creepy crawly because uh, <laughs> you know could possibly could see some you know capitulation down to this. 30,000 mark. So, you know, there's this speculation that it is going to go 30,000. If we do lose that 30,000, uh, definitely look at this uh, 20,000 scenario that, you know, I've been putting on the table for, you know, <laughs> since the beginning of the month. But, you know, uh, can it go that low? If the conditions are just right, you know, uh, as far as right now, we got a lot of stuff going on and a lot of. A lot of stuff in play as far as uh, news in the world, so we definitely got to keep an eye on that. And and uh, you know that price action could be possible as far as you know all the situation that's in it. That's why I've been keeping an eye on it. You know when I started seeing that bearish, uh, you know that head and shoulders pattern going to play, and I know a lot of other you know TBs were saying you know saying oh yeah that's it's going to rock it from here and all this kind of stuff. But as the news started kind of started playing to action, it really started making that pattern play out and that's what a lot of people didn't put into you know their game plan as far as looking at the chart and stuff they weren't you know throwing in that news action and how you know how rough the market is because you didn't really dig deep into that news to find out what's really going on because uh, it's shifty 50 50 on different news networks a lot of the time so as far as i'm watching it on the regular uh it's you never can tell but you know you gotta you gotta you gotta look at it as in a way that's you know you know not on a political sense but on a money sense this is going to affect the way the market's going to move and that's what i look for on the regular so so yeah we're looking at the head and shoulders pattern definitely look like it's you know played out and <laughs> we started hitting these lower price actions so uh definitely gonna keep an eye on that but if we start making some moves up to the upside and get some good recovery we had we got to get back over this uh, 41263 at the 786 and start making some uh, you know decent support and start making our moves to the upside. So keep an eye on that as far as BTC and uh, uh, and as far as uh, you know we got uh, as far as NCT goes and uh, definitely looking at you know if the possibility that we could start making some moves to the upside. Uh, <laughs> Uh, getting over that 786 but if we do get a night so we're looking for those lower price actions so keep an eye on that as far as scale uh same price action as far as breakout to the moves to the upside uh still gonna get over the 786 at 0.0698 make our way up to the point point uh point six one eight at point oh nine one one and make our moves to the upside so keep an eye on that as far as price action on ncd so everybody in nct good luck uh moving on up to scale scale is coming at point eleven cents it's got that same creepy crawly action that we were talking about just now with btc so a lot of a lot of these coins are basically setting and in this scenario, uh, scale, I got to always go out to the uh, year to date. Had a lot of con consolidation as far as scale is going. So a lot of the coins basically started for the bottom. So we did put this price action at 0.1767. As far as, uh, you know, the next 
next support and consolidation and uh, you know looking for that next move up so uh, keep an eye on that as far as scale especially if BTC starts getting some more DP action we're definitely going to see these lower price actions but you know as far as uh, a lot of the coins searching around for the bottoms once they hit those bottoms you know possibly could start making some moves to the upside but uh definitely you know start making our way up to the uh, the 786 so I'm, I'm you know i'm searching around i'm keeping my eyes out as you can tell some of the some of the coins are you know looking towards getting some moves and uh people are still buying so uh stuff still in the green here some's you know still in the red you know so <laughs> it's definitely uh uh you know it, it's it's we still got some movement and some motion going on in a lot of the projects and stuff so uh that you definitely got to keep an eye on that so same price action we had for scale as far as the last video we definitely got to come over that 786 at 0 0.2244 uh get some support and start making our way up to the 618 at 0.3867 and then you know as far as breakout breakout action we definitely got to get over this uh 0.61 and then make, make our way up to 0.75 and then as far as uh you know extremely bullish and making some breakout moves we got to get over this 0.9839 and uh you know get some consolidation and next move up so keep an eye on that as far as scale uh moving up to api three api3 was making some moves earlier today and uh definitely you know i was <clears throat> it was having some breakout action when everything was <laughs> getting some dippy action so, uh but it was holding strong you know down here at this this was basically a 618 here and then the 786 was down here at around 393 so uh it was still you know holding pretty strong and it did make a run to the upside uh so definitely looking for uh, you know if it does start you know get a good bounce here and making some moves to the upside at the 618 at 465 which it looks like it's already under 450 so you know possibly could be going uh back down to the uh, 786 at uh you know around 393 for some consolidation and you know possibly some sideways action uh but you know just until btc starts getting some moves up to the upside but possibly could start you know getting you know some if it's got that fu money <laughs> start making some moves to the upside so uh we'll definitely keep an eye on the ap3 we'll do another video tomorrow so everybody in ap3 good luck so keep an eye on that if we start making some moves to the upside we get over this 536 we'll definitely start breaking our way towards this 65 uh 652 uh and making our moves to the upside so keep an eye on that as far as breakout action but as far as a uh, lower price action we definitely could you know definitely come down to the uh, 349 and after that point you know we'll start looking at how low we can go so with api3 you know this is the the best chart we could get as far as this but on a shorter time frame you know you pull up some uh you know some definitely some micro fibs of so you know we do lose support there at 349 we're definitely looking at you know right here around 227 so keep an eye on that as far as api3 and for everybody in api3 good luck and you guys are going to remember this is not financial advice these are reviews and opinions on the market only and you guys are to do what's right for you so moving on up to ach ach is coming at a amazing price at 0.0386 uh definitely came under that 786 and uh we're at that point where it's uh how low you can you go but uh it definitely looks like it could possibly be making some moves up to the 786 at 0.0468 so if it does get back over to that point uh definitely you know as far as btc being <laughs> definitely undecided uh if we Get back over that 786 possibly looking at just some sideways action consolidation and until btc starts making his next move up and then you know making some moves to the upside and this ach gets that fu money and we definitely start uh, playing with this scenario here we come over the 786 make our way up to the 618 uh definitely come over uh retest the 0.0731 and start making our way to the upside breakout action 0.1698 so keep an eye on that scenario uh, you know if ACH does get that FU money and start making moves to the upside it's gonna be exciting to watch because that's a you know hell of a deal hell of an awesome price at a uh, uh, 0.0387 so keep an eye on that ACH and uh, yours uh, good luck and you always remember this is not financial advice either my views and opinions on the market only and you always got to do what's right for you moving on up to IOTIX IOTIX is coming in on, at point eight eight five uh we back you know we came under the uh, 786 and uh making our way down to that 0 0.0709 uh we actually you know i could possibly i know we got pretty close uh, i definitely missed out on that price action i know we came down into the 0 0.07 for <laughs> just a glimpse real quick and uh that would you know definitely would have been some amazing price action so if we do you know come back down and test the support at 0 0.0709 and we do come below that we're definitely going to see how low we can go on iotic so keep an eye on that price action and uh, especially if btc does get some more dippy action uh if we start making some moves to the upside same price action from the last video we've got to come over the 786 at 0.1 288 make our way up to the 618 at 0.17 
0.3742 and uh, make our way up to 0.3414. So uh, we'll keep an eye on that price action as far as IOTIC. So everybody in the points uh, tonight, uh, good luck. Uh, we'll, we'll come back on Monday. We'll be off uh, tomorrow for uh, <laughs> the Sunday and uh, be back on Monday when the market is, uh, you know, uh, we'll Got to definitely got to keep an eye on it and see what happens on Monday. I'm excited to see if we're, you know, what what's going to go on. If we're going to be going up or down, or <laughs> uh, so uh, everybody in uh, the coins we talked about tonight. Good luck, and you always remember this is not financial advice. These are my views and opinions on the market only, and uh, you always got to do what's right for you. So, Mr. Big Braids, uh, uh, so you always have a good afternoon, good evening, good morning, good night. Mr. Big Braids is signing out.